Well, good morning, kids. Uh, good morning, Hope. <laughs> good morning, saints in the congregation. Great to see you. I am here with my dogs barking in the background. <laughs> A windy Saturday afternoon. And, you know, I'm thinking about this new season. We're, we're in the season of Lent. You know what that is? We've got six weeks coming up as we get ready for the, the wonderful gift of Easter. And, uh, and it all started this past Wednesday, uh, not Windy Day, Wednesday, uh, with Ash Wednesday. I don't know if you were there for Food for Thought, but kind of here's what's happened. So in my office, I have a collection of the palm fronds from last year's Palm Sunday worship service. And I saved them so they would get nice and dry. And then I took them outside into the backyard here at the office and uh, pulled the uh, individual leaves off of the fronds, set them in a big, uh, big dish, and I lit them on fire. Don't try this at home unless your parents are helping you. Uh, and, but boy, that fire got really hot really quick. And look at it just taking over and those because those palm fronds were so so dry they just burned very very quickly but notice i'm doing it in a controlled environment so that the fire doesn't spread we don't want to do anything in the antelope valley to cause uh, a brush fire but as fast as it burned it also quickly burned out leaving just enough ashes for me to work with so then I took, picked out the big chunks and mashed it down with my fingers. And here's what I have left. This little bit of ashes from all of those palm fronds. Well, took them into my office, put them into two different bowls, one for me, one for Pastor John. And I took some olive oil, some uh, extra virgin olive oil, poured it in there. That's gonna be what mixes up the ashes. Then I took a paper clip and kind of mushed it around to try to blend in the oil uh, with the ashes. And if I found any big chunks of uh, sticks and things that are in there, I took those out as well. But I did this with both of the bowls. Uh, again, one that Pastor John's gonna be using and uh, one that I'm gonna be using. But olive oil doesn't smell very good. So I added a very special frankincense oil. Remember when the wise men brought gold frankincense and myrrh? Well, this is the frankincense oil. Then, on Wednesday night, we had a worship service. We called it Ash Wednesday. And Pastor John and I were able to use the ashes from last year's Palm Sunday, mixed with the olive oil and the frankincense oil, and we made the sign of the cross on people's foreheads. So they would be marked by Jesus and remember how much Jesus loves them. So there you have it. We are in the season of Lent. We are getting ready for the coming of Easter. We're taking time over the next six weeks to, to pray and reflect and draw close to God and realize what an amazing gift Easter is. And uh, we're gonna do some fun things together over the next six weeks, so let us pray. God, thank you so much for the chance to be here today for the season of Lent, as we are reminded of just how much you love us, the sacrifice that Jesus made. We pray over the next six weeks that we might be able to draw closer to you and be reminded of just how much you love us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right. See you next week. Great to see you. I'm outside on my back porch. It's a Wednesday. Wednesday. <laughs> Windy is what I meant to say. Well, I guess this is going to be at the end of the service.